um, good evening um, our thesis uh, work is on intrusion detection on NSL KDD um, our group mates are Alif Moino Lalom, Roba Yarub, Begum Roba, SM and myself SM in this year in Harun and our project is super uh, thesis project is supervised by Faisal Ahmed sir uh, our contents are motivation introduction motivation objectives platform what we are working and related work comparison with our work methods and accuracy comparison value and methodology parameter result and conclusion introduction cyber crime is the crime that involves in users computer device and internet cyber can, can be committed against an individual company or group or government, or government organization and private organization it may be harmful for some someone's reputation and it harms or even mental harm and direct or indirect harm different types kinds of company loss of billions of may a million money a every year we know that uber has compensate 100 million dollars to uh, for for their uh, user safety they invest uh, 100 million dollars for the user safety and and retrieve their file from the from the hackers Um, they they uh, in um, they invest hundred millions dollars just for their um, accounts, users' accounts and information. Um, and in in 2016, 2016, um, um, it, this news has gives a positive vibe to their company's reputation, and and they uh, they've saw many many improve. Um, a huge profit in their business just for this uh, valuable uh, work motivation our our thesis motivation is uh, millions of end active end user with huge or uh, scopes of vulnerability a security system must run to support the network and our idea is to catch the possible attacks dos probe r to help and it is this four types of net attacks in an network system um, and objectives our aim is to detect attack and secure the system and we use best nsl kdd data set and combine some classifier and several learning canon sbm for the best possible output related work there are many related work one of the related work is from uh, Suchaj Sapri, Ahmadi, Khandakar Islam and, and their data set is NSL KDD and KDD 99 and their algorithm is Rangunum Forest, Nibios and ANN and they find out 74% for Random Forest and Nibio, for the Nibios 61% and ANN for the 78.5% and another work is from Karuna S. Bosle, and their data set is KDD Cup 99 real time packet data for the execution. <coughs> and this is their data set, and their algorithm is CNN, KNN, ANN, and SPM, and NetBIOS. And they, they find out 97% accuracy from um, MNBIDS, modified NetBIOS intuition detection system another and, and um, related work is from Mila, Patrick and B B Baika and their data set is KDD and NSL and they find out they use random forest knife bios SBM 1R 0R J48 for their algorithm algorithm and they find out 99 percent point 99 point 92 percent for random forest 90.39 bias and for their SBM they find out 97.4 percent we use Ansible learning algorithm and an Adobe F text method 
and and this is uh, this help us to gain um, a better output in our project this is work and our next uh, presentation slide is presented by our group mate alif monolalo thank you indisar bin harun hello everyone good morning to you all this is alif alam i would like to talk about uh, which platform we are use most of the time we are use google colab and sometime we try to implement our data set in jupyter notebook uh, which data set we are use we are basically use k nsl 99 data set which uh, was uh, first published in 1999 in this data set we see there is a lot of problem a lot of attack uh, dos attack uh, which is Dan daniel uh, attack a at a time there is so many requests in a system this attack is called a dos attack is there is lot of, of example like uh, a pod napsun land in dos attack and now talking about r2 u2 r user to root attack why an attacker access to the normal user and uh, attack this system uh, like uh, social engineering now i am talking about uh, r12 remote to local attack collect the vulnerable data from the system and attack this system and uh, now uh, it's uh, probing attack when uh, we are using open wifi wifi network uh, we are sharing same type of uh, uh, networking access with the attacker this attack is called it probe attack in our data set first uh, we are loading this data set uh, when we see this data set there is a, a most uh, of numerical value but there is some categorical value we need to con uh, convert this categorical value into numerical value for this reason we uh, uh, we use level encoding and one not encoding to convert this uh, categorical value into numerical value we are using feature scaling for uh, for normalize the range of independent variable and find the various kind of magnitude compare all of the uh, level value and in here uh, we are using standard scalar and here is uh, our output of uh, this uh, feature scaling value i am talking about feature selection in feature selection i am using uh, an obf test uh, when and there is a lot of feature uh, we need to separate uh, uh, all the feature this time uh, we are using an obf test uh, how we use uh, an obf test import select app based and uh, it is a generic model and uh, uh, we we use uh, the best is f score to uh, 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 collect a uh, uh, feature uh, we, uh, how many feature we will uh, collect uh, it's uh, here or uh, we will collect a uh, 10 fe best feature which is uh, 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 help uh, for our algorithm in to build a model first we use sbm which is support vector meshing providing a binary classification mechanism based on finding a, b a dividing a hyperplane between a set of sample which linear separable if the data distribution is fundamentally non linear trick is to transform the data set to a higher dimension and hopefully this data nearly separable is that hyper dimension there is a, a, a kernel uh, like uh, tuning polynomial kernel and uh, tuning uh, radical basis kernel our another mo uh, model is knn which is k ne uh, nearest neighbor we have to select k value for this k nearest neighbor this value indicate the, that how many nearest neighbor we uh, are going to consider in term of distance for this there is a two type of parameter how we calculate the distance there is a two type of method is uh, li like uh, euclidean and another is uh, manhattan we use euclidean distance for this uh, se uh, separate uh, cal for this calculation and uh, we we see if we uh, increase our n value there is separation is uh, so much uh, and uh, the Uh, th this is the most important parameter parameter we need to tune in k the number of neighbor used to make this class dimension 
द मिनिमम वैल्यू इज वन हुई केस वी ओनली टूक द क्लोजेस्ट एवर फॉर इट्स सेपरेशन इस इस प्रिडिक्शन टू मेक आवर डिसीजन आफ्टर कम्प्लीटिंग टू टाइप ऑफ एलगोरिदम उइ आर यूजिंग एंड सेम्बल लार्निंग एलगोरिदम हुईच टू ट्राइट फाइन बेस्ट रेजल्ट इन हेयर उइ कम्बाइंड टू एलगोरिदम हुईच एस बी एम एन के एन एन डाटा सेट हुईच इज कॉल्ड ऑरिजिनल डाटा सेट दिस इज इन दिस डाटा सेट देर इज मेनी मेनी कॉलम मेनी रो Now I uh, I said that ensemble mean we are uh, combining multiple model. In ensemble there are two type of bagging is uh, one of the uh, one type of ensemble. Um, in uh, bagging uh, we with uh, sampling this original data and uh, try to uh, fit in our model and uh, uh, try to find uh, try to find the output uh, from our model. and uh, com uh, combine the majority try to find the majority vote from this uh, model and and uh, th this how we are using uh, bagging technique our next slide presented by ruba begum ruba thank you thank you alif monul alam i am representing the slide name is confusion matrix a confusion matrix is a synopsis of expectation result on an order issue process for calculating a confusion matrix we need a data set or an approval data set make an expectation for each line in our data set from the normal result and forecast tally we are classified in this data set into two parts the quantity of right focus for each class the quantity for wrong focus for each class coordinated by the class that was un anticipated this gives us the true positive for correctly predicted even values false positive for incorrectly predicted even values true negative for correctly predicted no even values false negative for incorrectly predicted no even values so in this slide uh, we can see that there are some values so here the confusion matrix have been created so here uh, i uh, we have used the row for the actual value and the predicted value for the column so uh, uh, this uh, this uh, prediction and evaluation uh, in this three algorithm name is svm canon and ensemble learning and we detect four types of attack dos probes r2l and u2r attack in this segment we see that uh, cross validation and cross validation is the important part of our work cross validation is used to access the predictive uh, performance of the models and to judge how they performs outside the sample to a new data set also known as test data set but uh, basically cross validation used to access the predictive performance in this flow diagram in this flow diagram we see our first task is to import the python library then we loaded our data set we have done data processing by two step step 2 uh, r cleaning and feature selection then we work with 20% data set from test uh, test and 80% from training then we applied our desired algorithm can and sbm ensemble and and we data set uh, togetherly basically uh, we combining all the data set and at last we measured the performance so in this slide uh, sbm Uh, as we, we predict the sbm value and we are uh, using preci precision recall f1 accuracy and we are using some equation the equation for the accuracy is tp plus tn divided by t 
TP plus FP plus TN plus FN for the prediction TP divided by TP plus FP for the recall TP divided by TP plus FN and F1 for the F1 score the equation is 2 TP divided by 2 TP plus FP plus FN so uh, we are using these equations and we get our desired value in this table we see dos attack have the highest accuracy value so uh, our next canon uh, table we see um, also for the precision recall f1 and accuracy dos attack give the highest accuracy value uh, for the ensemble learning, uh, there is DOS and probe are uh, are most more fluctuating. Their values, uh, some their values. So the DOS and probe are also give the best values. And in terms of these two, DOS give the also best give the best value for the ensemble learning. Result analysis: the final training. Uh, test phase is worried about the production and evolution of a test set of the Canon model and may depend on the ideal hypermeter set found so far in the model selection phase. After finding the parameter, we build the model using the NSL KDD train data set for train and try the model utilizing the test data set. Basically, we are comparing train data set and uh, uh, test data set for our work. We are always analyzing the value for the train data set and we are always analyzing the value for the test data set. In this uh, segment, the, uh, we see the bar chart and the slide name is attack class distribution. So, in this attack class distribution, uh, the, the, there are four attack DOS normal probe R2L U2R. For the normal attack, we see the value uh, around the 50 percent is, and uh, for the uh, for the uh, normal value, uh, the frequency percentage uh, test uh, around the 40 value, and for the U2R, the value around the zero. Uh, for the frequency present train and for the frequency present test data set. And uh, for the next slide, our final output is the ensemble method to combine various algorithms to get a valuable result. Ensemble method work with majority voting. In here, we first calculate the individual classification model calculation in including precision recall accuracy f1 score we see uh, 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 we see uh, our table uh, there are uh, various uh, various uh, uh, we get the various value in this segment we see the accuracy level of sbm 0.985615 accuracy level of canon 0.9888 Zero 08 and the accuracy level of uh, ensemble learning 0 0.989002. In these uh, three algorithms, we get the best uh, value for the ensemble learning. And the next uh, segment is the conclusion part. Intuition detection machine learning model was developed using the Kenyaris neighbors and support vector machine ensemble algorithm. The model was run on various occasions with various factors and conditions to concrete how every parameters affect the model. So here we originally run the program with all algorithms to discover various types of attack. At that point, we run a few times for consolidating the two algorithms for each occasion. At that point, we choose the outcome for larger part voting to find out which algorithm to give 
us more accurate result. The fundamental point of this research was to evaluate the conditions under which the classifications accuracy for the models on the NSL KDT dataset was achieved. So in this part, in future we needed to update our work with additional precision and we want to implement Exibus algorithm and we want to increase our accuracy value. Thanks, uh, thanks for listening our presentation. This is the now this is the question answer segment. Thank you.